morning i'm making another vlog today because guess what i'm competing i don't know where i'm supposed to look on this video maybe here i'm competing today and i'm doing a 60 meters yeah i'm excited this time last year i was basically frustrated because when it came to january i started to be able to run and i uh, i really just wanted to know lord is this the year and obviously as the year went on i i learned a lot of things if he's not saying yes that means it's not <laughs> like it's really that simple but i just was like wanted him to say yes i guess and he, it wasn't um when i first i oh, sorry i came back to athletics in 2015 october and i got an october on the track in february 2016 and i received a prophetic word march 2015 right someone had a vision about me and in the vision this person didn't know that i was an athlete in the vision they saw me run on the athletic track and at first i was weak and then the lord said now is the time to rima and when the lord said now is the time to rima that's when in the spirit was released to me like strength and speed and stamina and all that kind of thing and i began to run so fast and then she saw me in a forest and i had like tims on and everything was in my way everything was hindering me i was moving it and pushing it out of the way and so by that time based on the journey that i had gone through already i knew that okay i understand that when god you know when you first become a christian you just think if god gives you word it's the next day but obviously as you grow in the lord you come to understand that how god works and him giving a word doesn't mean it's happening the next day so anyway i understood that okay that word until god says now is the time i'm not gonna see these things that she's talking about and it basically gave me confidence that i had heard god right in the sense of him telling me to come back to athletics sort of thing so anyway i just continued so obviously the whole of 2016 uh continued in obedience like way to train etc moving into 2017 which is why last year i was like okay lord is it now because you know you gave me this word last year that now um, and the, the word I did receive in January actually was the Lord told me that I'll be full term by the summer but I just didn't really take that word I didn't really listen because full term is not the same as um, being given birth or seeing the baby <laughs> so that was my frustration which is why I patience was my word of 2017 coming the end of the year I received a prophetic word from the same person so I probably saw that person like two or three times in a whole year so the last time they gave me a word was 2016 march so 2017 december i received a word from the same person i know the lord works at that on purpose anyway the word was she saw strength and agility and um speed being released to me in the spirit and it's so funny because at the time i didn't pay any attention this was the 31st of december at the time i didn't pay any attention not not i didn't pay any attention i listened to the word i was encouraged but i didn't really receive the word in its fullness so as we crossed over into the new year i'm not even gonna lie to you in the natural i just saw <laughs> it's just literally like <laughs> as soon as it became 2018 i began to be able to run i don't understand literally there's been an acceleration in my ability when i really wanted the lord to give me a word to tell me that now is the time he wasn't saying anything and then coming into this year i didn't really ask the lord is this the year i just said okay i'm gonna be faithful i'm finally i'm finally accepting where i am and all that kind of stuff but then he has given me these words saying all of that to say as to why i'm particularly excited about today indoors wasn't even on the menu can i even explain how much indoors wasn't even on the menu so the fact that i'm doing it is really exciting and the fact that i can go in there not only have i got spiritual confirmation but in the natural i'm actually doing well so i'm really excited to see how today goes so save me on the journey today guys and i'll see you later Sometimes I feel just leave before you and make you work your problems out. Yeah. You can't take it on you. Listen to me. Jesus. How can I live life without you? That's what I want to do. That's what I want to do. So who can stop me more from raising my life? I just had my first heat, guys. What do you think, Coach? This is for the vlog. Um, I like the beginning. I feel you could uh, execute the ending. A bit more efficient, but that's what rounds are about. It's it's all you know. mm -hmm. so in the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I have a base now, so I'm ready to go now, guys. I am ready to go. 
haven't run, I eat my PB to be fair, so I haven't run that since 2010, which is eight years. So looking forward to the semi, see you guys after. Anytime you and Nanjin go through, you send me problems and like a movie. Precious moments erase all my memory. It's been a good day. Today was a day where I can definitely say the Lord has confirmed we are on the up. We are on the up. So yeah, I'm happy with today. PB twice. Equal from PB the first round. PB then PB'd. Can't ask for more than that. Body is in a good place. And I can only just take confidence from this and say, Lord, thank you finally. We are coming out of the grave y'all we're coming out of the grave anyway it is time to do the most important thing of the day and that is eat so i'll see you guys next time thanks for watching this vlog <laughs>